This married couple chooses to survive only off their pee. I use it in my hair. I use it as eardrops sometimes. I use it as eye drops sometimes. Beware. Beware. Hey baby! Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel for you guys today. My name is Ryan, and welcome, baby. Welcome. Oh my God, y'all! <laughs> Look where I'm at. I'm home. Why am I home? I've been in LA for the longest, and I'm finally back home. You know, I almost forgot that I, I this is like my normal home. You know, I almost forgot that I film here. I do things here because why? When I walked in this room before on Thanksgiving Day, I was like, who lives here? Like, this, what's this nice, got a little vinyl moment, got a little sloth on the bed. That's how long I was gone. You know, and I honestly missed it because I love being in my little area, like when I film and stuff. Being here is just like, I feel home, feel better about myself. Anyway, so today's gonna be an interesting video because, okay, so I was scrolling on YouTube and My Strange Addiction popped up. I was like, oh my god. Like, I've watched My Strange Addiction, who has actually, who hasn't. But then I was like, wait, should I do a video on it? So I came across this video and it was talking about some, um, 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 couple of drinks and baths in their own pee. Still addicted. Girl, why were we addicted in the fucking first place? That is disgusting. The way they're in the thumbnail just gives me the vibe. Something in that pee brings them joy. I was thinking maybe this is my chance to figure out. Maybe they got some science behind it why we should drink our pee. And maybe I might be a change man by the end of the video. So today we're going to be watching My Strange Addiction. But before you get this video, my martinis, make sure you like this video, make sure you subscribe. And also, continue to listen to my song. I just want to say the last video that I posted about my song, I literally checked my stats because that's normally what I do. I check my stats on my song, like what's going on. Why did the spikes go up the next day after I uploaded my video talking about my song? And I just want to say thank you. We're already close to 11,000 streams. So I just want to say thank you so much for supporting me. This means so much to me. More music is coming next year, maybe early. I don't know. Maybe a hit, hit, hit here and there. All I know is I just want to say thank you. Make sure that you want to do Mark on the front, me a little on me. Now, without further ado, let's go ahead and get to this video. My name is Nick. Cheers. My name is Aubrey. And we are addicted to drinking our urine. Ew! Ew! I'm sorry. I just got. <laughs> Just the way he gulped that, it was just something normal. I'm sorry. I had to catch that because I almost, I almost threw up. And I have not drank water for years now. Each day I'm consuming about a half gallon of fresh urine. It smells like buttery popcorn. Oh my God. Oh my God. This is a mental disorder. This is a mental issue. It smells like butter. And then before he just said that he hasn't drank water in a long ass time. So what the fuck is smelling good like butter? That piss sure ain't smelling like butter. That shit smell like metal and, 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 and dirty rocks. Never in a million years would I think that I would have a son that would be drinking his own urine. Right now, we're about to take a pee shower. It almost feels like a drug. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gagging, I'm gagging because I'm just thinking now like, how do you smell good in public? You are in literal urine. They wash in their liquid body waste. That, that's what they, <laughs> you know, they're different. You know, I'm, I'm still not gonna judge. So maybe they might have a reason why we should start bathing and pee. I consider myself a natural lifestyle enthusiast. I eat natural things that come from nature. I don't use any makeup. Unless it's a very special occasion. Okay, well, you know what? Maybe I might start drinking pee because why is the skin actually looking good? You know, and she's 29. Aubrey, the skin is looking good. Does that mean I need to start drinking piss? Oh, why her husband? I'm sorry. I was y'all know it was gonna come. Why her husband kinda Does he drink other people's piss? I'm just wanting to know. Oh my gosh! Nick and Aubrey both drank 200 gallons of urine each year. You know that could have been substituted as with water. How are you surviving without water that long? I feel like our bodies need water. Am I missing something or no? 200 gallons of urine each year. You know, they would be good friends with peaches because she want to drink her piss. <laughs> Oh my god. On an average day, I probably drink between a half gallon and a gallon, so maybe three quarts of pee a day. Ow! Ow! Put it down! Put it down! Put it down! I don't think 
I'm gonna make it through this video. I really don't think I'm gonna make it through this video. Okay, so this is what I'm seeing in my head. So they pee in the toilet. They take a, 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 a cup and scoop it out and say, mm, my daily dose of water. Oh, I mean pee. <laughs> and drink. Hello. Each day I'm consuming about a half gallon of fresh urine. I no longer drink water, and I have not drank water for years now. You really do feel more nourished drinking your urine than you do drinking water. Are you okay? You're saying you feel more nourished drinking your pee than water, okay? I respect you. I don't respect that saying. If you consume your pee, how are you staying hydrated? Do y'all get what I mean? Well, it's delicious. It tastes pretty sweet. It smells like buttery popcorn, but like not super pungent. I feel vibrant, vital, and more in love with myself. No, you're forcing yourself to feel that way. You are miserable. You are down. This is a mental thing, you know? I just want you to know that you're just telling your brain after you drink the pee, like, oh, I feel refreshed. You know, our, our brains play tricks on us, you know? Our brains are very powerful. And it will believe anything that we say to it sometimes, you know? You're missing the root issue, and the root issue is you. Think about your future. Okay, I'm sorry to pause again. They are doing some type of sound effect because ain't no fucking way they're gulping that loud. Because the gulp is like, it's sending chills down my body. I don't like it. I use it for my skincare routines. And if I have a scrape, a cut, any opened, exposed wound, I'll always use urine topically for that. That is the most dirty thing I've ever heard. So a open wound, flesh in your eyes. You take your piss and rub it on. Not even no alcohol, no peroxide. Do you not think about how you're gonna smell when you go out? I use it in my hair. I use it as eardrops sometimes. I use it as eye drops sometimes. Ah! 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 Stop! 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 <laughs> my orbs are in shambles just by looking at that. I'm, I, ah! Think about it. Swish it around my mouth like mouthwash. How the fuck does he have straight teeth? Why does he look good? You know, I think that's what's throwing me off. That's making me like, should I start bathing in my own pee? Will I look like this? Because why do they still look pretty good? And he's cute. I spent a couple years not living here with my family. I did a lot of traveling. I lived in the Dominican Republic for a year. I lived in Hawaii for a little bit, Nicaragua a little bit. Wait, what did you say? A little bit, Nicaragua a little bit. Excuse me? Now, hold on now. I heard a little N word. Right now, we're about to take a pee shower. We're gonna pour our pee on our hair our skin rub it in so we can be out in the sun get more tan stay more hydrated with our skin and just enjoy ourselves in the heat they look so concerned they look so concerned it's disgusting i think like pouring it in his hair it's like uh, like dumping it on you you know i think that that's like gross <laughs> Whenever I have urine on my skin and I'm in the sun, it feels electric. I feel euphoria. I just feel so much more connected to my body and the earth. I just know the smell is out of this fucking world. They're on a hot sunny day. It's probably like 80, 90 degrees. Think about how this piss is on their skin and the sun is just beaming it. It's making it warm. It's cooking it. I'm living my life. People can think whatever they want about it. It's really like none of my business what people think about me. So if you think I'm crazy, like keep it to yourself. Okay, period. <laughs> I love the confidence. You like it? I love it. I stand on confidence. And you know, I love that he is confident about his word. And he's like, you know, fuck everybody who thinks I'm weird, even though he is. I love that type of mentality. I tell kids, keep, keep being confident. Oh, okay. Nick first tried urine on vacation during a medical emergency. A medical emergency? Okay, then how did you drink your piss? Somebody told you in the medical field to drink your piss? I was in Aruba. My hands clenched up really hard. You could commonly, I guess, refer to this as a panic attack. It was, I was breathing too fast. I lost control of my breathing and- I'm sorry, I'm listening to this story, but like, this is kind of cute to me. Like, it gives like animal. <laughs> um, don't come for me. I, you know, he's lost. I can help him. I can change him. <laughs> I was breathing too fast. I lost control of my breathing and I didn't know what to do. So I gave a call to a friend of mine who I trusted to potentially have a solution. And the solution that he presented to me was to drink my urine. And I was skeptical. I asked him like three or four times. And he continued to just repeat himself like, you got to do it, bro. This man set you up. And you don't, you don't see it? This man probably was playing around with you. And he thought that you knew that he was joking too. And now we're here. I tried it. I peed in a jar. 
And Why is he documenting this in the, the phone? And as soon as I took like one sip and touched it to my tongue, my hands were like releasing and I felt like my nervous system like let go of my hand. Again, you know, like I said before, your brain plays crazy tricks on you. Come, come here, let me talk to you. Stop drinking your piss. The brain is a powerful thing. If we believe something, we're gonna, you know, let our brains feel like it. So if I tell myself, you know, you know, I just wanna say I'm the king of delusion. So I want you to listen to this. Imagine you tell yourself, I have a million dollars. You're gonna believe that, you know, you are worthy of that money. I am worthy of a million dollars. I am worth more than a million dollars. I'm a billion, I'm a vanity, you know? So, you know, I can lie to myself. I don't like celery. I can eat celery and say, mm, this is good. I'm lying to myself. You are lying to yourself and it's a mental disorder. I love you. You don't have to do this. I will be praying for you in my prayer. So I first found Nick on social media before we became friends. I slid into Nick's DMs <laughs> and invited him to come stay with me and um, just hit it off. I was drinking urine for about five months before I met him. When wow, so it's crazy just to see this happen. She was already drinking piss. Then he drank piss, so I guess they were meant to be. When we first met, we actually didn't even eat food. It was like so natural to not eat and just yeah. drink pee. Not only do Nick and Aubrey drink their own urine, but they have tried each other's urine too. I knew it. You know, this a piss kink and something's rooted in this and I'm going to talk to a therapist about this for you. Something had to happen. I'm nosy, I'm gonna figure it out. I'm gonna text them. After two days of meeting him, we were driving back from the Redwoods and he brought a jar with him and we didn't pull over, he just peed in the car. And then I looked over right when he was done and he looked at me and was like, huh? Like, kind of like, you wanna? And I was like, sure. And so I did, I would. Wait, I want her man. Oh, they look so like animalistic. Like, I like this aesthetic on them though. I'm not gonna lie, like they just look rough and they look like they're just in tune with spirituality and nature. It's so like. Like, rugged and I love a rough man that looks like this like he's hot so not only do we drink our urine we also snort it what is go <laughs> I am I'm confused so she is bit down <laughs> She is bit down in her pants with the jar to piss in it. And he is behind her pissing in a cup. I just want that to soak in. I can't even look at this picture in like normalness. Urine snorting is when you literally snort your urine. So you're breathing in essentially your urine up into your sinuses and then swallowing it down. These are like soft drug addicts. Think about it. Snorting. Sniff and then swallow and then sniff, sniff and then swallow and repeat. Aubrey has struggled with nose drinking in her experience. So my goal today is to help her make improvements and get a little better at drinking through her nose. Maybe that's a good thing because you know, we're not even supposed to do that from the get go. All right, so I'll show you first. Okay. Cheers. So you don't go super fast. No. He is treating this as if he just did cocaine. This is their cocaine. When people tell me they can't get past the mental aspect of snorting it, I say, stay stuffy. Oh, okay. Wow, okay. You know, I started this video off a little judgmental. And I think I ended the video still judgmental. If anything, this made me want to take a bath and in the shower and I just took my shower. So I learned nothing. I just learned that this is a mental disorder and all the respect to them though. <laughs> Her well, that is gonna be a wrap for today's video. I'm honestly in disbelief. This whole entire video has me uh, gagged. If they have kids, their kids can run away and get far and never have to see their parents for this because this is a lot. When has it ever gotten that bad to drink your own piss, you know? You know, do you, but I will judge from afar. I wanna know your thoughts in the comment section. I learned a lot that the world is ending. <laughs> but I loved you and I enjoyed you, my babies. Bye. Boop. <laughs>